At a closed down Elwood, Indiana plating factory, smoke lingers where a massive fire roared last night. And there was flames shooting high. And I mean, it's past the power line. I was impressed by the power of it and the force. I was actually standing almost out by the street and I could feel the heat and the force from the flames. More than 30 fire departments responded to douse the flames while police, suspecting arson, began speaking with witnesses. We started getting some information that there was four young men seen leaving the town, leaving the building. Overnight, police caught up with and arrested four juveniles ranging from 13 to 17 years old. Neighbors were shocked to hear one of the suspects is the son of Elwood Mayor Ron Arnold. I was shocked, uh, you know, a public figure like that, and unfortunately his son's involved. Yeah, I feel bad for the family, you know, having to go through something like that, but, you know, it is it is devastating. You know? Pretty surprised because usually he's a really good kid, and he's a really good friend, and I'm surprised that he would do something like that. Mayor Arnold released a statement this morning saying, as difficult as this situation is as mayor, it is made more difficult by the fact that my son is one of the juveniles involved. This revelation has been devastating to me and my family. We covet your prayers as we walk through this difficult time for our city and my family. Police say the suspects could make their first court appearance as early as Monday. This is also when state and federal arson investigators will be on the scene to piece together more details. We will determine the uh, nature and cause of the fire. Uh, once we do that, then we'll take our case to juvenile authorities and we'll go from there. Chance Walser, RTV6.